welcome to week three. Uh, quick topic about hard work. Uh, you may uh, not know it, but I'm assuming you all do know that you know college work is hard work. All right, uh, it is very difficult, and you know sometimes other people don't understand that. That could be family members, friends, employee. You know, uh, they just don't get it sometimes. That you know this is hard work, uh, and sometimes students don't get it because maybe they just don't put the work in. All right, um, but it is hard work, and it does require a real 10 to 40 hours a week. Depending how many courses you're taking, uh, if you're online or you're actually going to campus, you know, it, it, there's variables there, but you, you have to put real time in, and uh, sometimes we have a problem with that. Uh, the time cannot be compromised uh, with distractions. You know, we have so many distractions going on in our lives anymore. Uh, you know, sometimes it does uh, distract. Um, you know, I got the, I got Doug down here. I don't know if you've seen that movie. I think up in the air, up, uh, yeah, up where the Doug always got distracted with squirrels. But anyway, we have all these other things. We have cell phones. We have, you know, family. We have work. We have other things. And uh, you know, the problem is, um, you know, I guess it's called multitasking. And multitasking is a good skill, and it's all, and even in job interviews, it's a skill that employers ask about. However, uh, it, multitasking is the enemy of the college student, all right? Uh, because you know you're trying to focus on something. Uh, you're supposed to put at least 10 plus hours a week in. These are real hours, you know, one two hours every night uh, or more. Uh, you know, and you have to be 100% focused on it. And if you're not, you're cheating yourself because you're not putting the time in. Uh, remember, you know, you made a commitment to yourself uh, to earn your degree and to pay for your degree. All right, so you're paying for it. And uh, you know, my analogy here is: uh, Would you pay for a week's vacation and then not go? I mean, would you uh, fork out a couple thousand dollars or whatever it costs to go on this vacation and not show up? Uh, so. Uh, why would you why would you pay for college and not show up uh, you know if you're in a classroom and if you go to campus you have to actually show up and if you don't you, you get a failing for attendance you get a uh, failing grade and you even end up getting dropped from a course or out of, dropped out of school because you're not putting time in um, so you know you as an online student you're being entrusted uh, to put that time in you know the same amount of time you know it's not supposed to be a free pass because it's online all right uh, and you find yourself struggling that's one of the reasons you're not putting the time in um, yes it's hard work uh, but your reward for the hard work is you know earning your degree and like I said you know um, you know majority of the times when I have you know detailed conversations with students and they're having problems in that conversation they kind of forget that they're talking to me and they met and I find out oh they've only done uh, 30 minutes this week and instead of 10 hours um, you know if, they, if you put the 10 hours in most time you'll figure it out but you know again um, you know I'm there to help you uh, if, if you need help or anything so that's the other thing um, you know don't be hesitant to ask for help all right because I understand it is difficult it is hard work you got all these other things going on in life and so but you are here you're paying for it and you need to get everything out of it that you're paying for